about Mormons, I basically just heard that they're like a cult, you know? They like marry people off at 13 to like 45 year olds and just that weird stuff. So it kind of like put me off at first. I've also gotten people who don't swear around me because I'm Mormon. They call me some names that I don't, it words they don't use. And sometimes people are like, oh, you believe in two different gods? I'm just like, no. People are like super surprised. They're like, wait, you, you're not the same religion as your parents? Like, has everyone been thinking this about me every time I tell them about this? And I just became really worried about it and like really offended, but like hurt. Like for the rest of like the week, I couldn't stop thinking about it. And I was My lab partners in biology, they actually, one of them started up the whole bullying, like, you know the Broadway play, The Book of Mormon? He started seeing stuff and making references to that and just pretty much bullying me. <laughs> When people have found out that I am Mormon, then sometimes they act very cautious or careful about like everything they do or say around me when I'm a normal person too. It's like sometimes like people stop telling like jokes and some people like stop like they just feel like they have to talk like all like proper and like nice and it's like no. Some people they find out that I'm Mormon and they're surprised and some of them are surprised because of how normal I am, I guess. Some people don't invite me to things because she's like, oh, she's Mormon, she's just gonna judge us for what we do. But that's also not the case, so. I don't go around broadcasting that I'm Mormon, and so when my friends find out, they're, they look at me weird like, really, I would never have thought, but. And then they just treat me normal, because it's like, yeah, I'm just a Mormon. Don't treat me any different. Okay, no, one thing people think we are, people always think we're Amish. Yeah. People think we're Amish. We're not Amish. I have a cell phone. <laughs> we're not Amish. My mom's inactive and my dad is not a member and my brother's not a member. I mean, like, I have a very life. great family. Like, yeah. I love my family, but they're not Mormon, so I don't go to church with them. I don't go to church with them. Well, I go with my grandma. But... I think, like, as teenagers, we all have the same struggles, some more than others, but, like, we're not really different than any other teenagers. We have the same feelings, we have the same emotions, like we're still normal teenagers. We just might have more guidelines and we might be more aware of the things in the world. Now. We have more standards, I guess. And it's not always, it's not a bad thing. And a lot of people think it's restrictions. A lot of people are like, well, you guys have so many rules, but it's like, the cool thing about it is that they're not rules. That most of the Mormon teenagers choose to do these things, that it's like, well, you have to do this, you have to do that. No, we don't. We choose to. Because other than that, everyone's like, oh, that's cool, you're a Mormon, that's awesome. But then I met some Mormons. I'm actually friends with a lot of Mormons. And, like, none of that stuff is true. That's just, like, crazy stuff that people say. And all my Mormon friends are really nice, and they're good people. Oh, 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 oh,